welcome to the Alice Springs Masters Games Daily Wrap for Day 2. Well, there are a few sore heads around after a huge opening ceremony, but that didn't stop many of the team sports competition from getting underway, including baseball, basketball and hockey. Let's take a look at some of the Day 2 highlights. Highlands in New South Wales, near Canberra. And how have the Golden Galahs gone today? Uh, pretty good. We had a good win. Um, it was hot this morning. Not used to the weather, the heat. So uh, yeah, it's pretty good. And what about those heads? There's a few sore heads from last few night. Sore heads from last night. Yeah, yeah too right. We didn't get uh, a lot of sleep, but a lot of beer. And what's the tactics then? Uh, you know, backing up the next day. More water. <laughs> and how do you think you will go this week? Uh, I don't know. We haven't seen all the teams play yet, so we'll see what happens. Take it as it comes. Is this your first time to the Masters game? Yep. Yeah, so what brought you here this year? Uh, just some traction going away, a bit of time away, and uh, play some hockey. So that's been it. And you're having a good time so far? So far, yeah, it's been great. Nice ice creams up here in uh, Alice Springs. <laughs> okay, good luck. Thank you. Um, so this is your first Masters Games, how's it going so far? Yeah, very well. Um, the Galvin team has been up here a few times, but um, myself this is the first visit, so um, Galvin Glass have had a reputation of coming up here on a, on to the Alice Springs Games and they always enjoy themselves, so I thought it was a great opportunity for me to come along and, and join with them. And what about last night, have you recovered well? Oh yes, of course, yes. I was, behave myself of course but uh, it was a great atmosphere to go out and see everyone out and about and, and it was great to see all the signage up and everyone in a very friendly mood and it was great. <laughs> and uh, the men's hockey, any front runners? Who do you think your biggest rival is going to be? Well I think it's the old Crows I think um, <laughs> with the over 35s. We just played the old Crows over 45s. We beat them 11-1 I think so that was a, a pretty good effort with the, the boys up the front scoring the goals so it went really well. Okay, good luck for the rest of the week. Okay, thank you very much.
Okay, so how have the dead ants gone today in the uh, women's hockey competition? We played really hard and we did really well, but we didn't. We didn't get to do our dead Warm out there, is tough going? It's, it's not, not all that going. different to the heat we're used to at home, no. It's a lot different to me. <laughs> <laughs> and um, did uh, the opening ceremony maybe have a little impact no. on uh, today? No. Might have had a huge no. impact on me. <laughs> <laughs> a huge impact on me. No. We enjoyed ourselves immensely last night. Fabulous night. I've yeah, heard yeah, a few croaky voices over there though. Was there a bit uh, of singing going on? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Girls get together, there's a lot of stuff happening. Yeah. And what do you think about the Masters Games in, in general? It's all about the fun. Oh, it is, and it's fabulous. Mm. Absolutely fabulous. This is not my first trip. That's first my trip. first trip. Yeah, so it's not my first trip, and yeah, I've come back yeah. every two years. Yeah. And what do you think then, your first time? I oh, know, I'm having a ball, having a blast, uh, meeting all different new people. The actual team that I'm actually playing with is the Cairns girls. So that's not where I'm from either, so it's been great. Yeah. So really you're good. meeting lots of new friends? Lots, oh, absolutely. Lots, lots, yeah. lots. Yeah. yeah. No, it's great. we got more, we got lots more fun to go through yet. <laughs> All right, well, have a great week. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you, you have a good week too. So, uh, how are the heads today? The heads aren't too bad. There was a little bit of restraint about one o'clock in the morning. Okay, and so how'd you go this morning? Uh, we played with an old team against a young team because it was a round robin competition and we got a old fashioned hiding. What was the score? Uh, 10 or 11 1, I think. Oh dear. Oh dear, yes. So onwards and upwards from here? That's right. We actually play against a sensible team, an old team, next time, so that'll be fine. And how's everyone faring though after the opening ceremony? Is there a few uh, you know, croaky voices? I notice the sunnies are on. There are some that I'm really surprised that they're upright, let alone playing hockey today. And um, we did have one person who actually remained nameless who ended up in the, the ice bin because it's big enough and he just jumped straight in. So nobody's using the ice much today, for some reason. Uh, and what about the Masters Games in general? It's a great week. It's a beautiful week. Um, I've been coming up off and on pretty much since it started and whenever I don't come I always wish I had, so it's a beautiful experience. Okay, best of luck and hopefully uh, a better result next time. Thanks very much.
story behind the Alice Indians? Uh, the Alice Indians were formed by a group of people, Dutch players, about 20 odd years ago. We, uh, we used to come down to, to play touch and the Masters came along and we played Masters, not as Indians, but as a number of different teams. And we saw um, all these guys, like these Townsville guys who were playing here beside us, and guys from Sydney would come and they'd have proper uniforms and have so much fun, and we would just turn up and play and go away. So we decided if we wanted people to come back to our town year after year to do this, let's do it properly. So we formed the Alice Indians. This is our 10th Masters as, as Indians. And over the years, we've probably got about 120 Braves and scores who come and play and their kids and this is the first year we've actually got one of our Braves kids actually old enough to play so it's it's awesome. That's how and, we start. And what's the story behind the names? I understand you know there's some pretty special names going around here. It's all in with the Indian theme. Of course we uh, we have the week of the Masters totally themed Indians. We we have uniforms that we must wear all week. Every Indian player has a name depending on and that's derivative of their name in real life or their job or some habit they may have or something something annoying that people do when you when you um try and, and they're usually very appropriate and yeah i understand there's some fines if you don't uh, call the names right all those fines. well that's part of the the tradition we we use indian names all week we we have to have our uniforms on there's always fines for, for swearing and sledging and all sorts of things that we couldn't do in real life anyway, but it's just more appropriate this week. And it's all, and it's all part of the, the fun and it's oh, a absolutely. pretty massive week. Absolutely, it's part of the fun. It's a massive week. <laughs> and we not only have Indians playing touch, by the way, we have Indians swimming, doing athletics, playing squash, um, and we all try and get around to, to their events as well and have a bit of fun. And Indians are pretty much renowned, actually, in town for, for being fun-loving tribe people. And how did you get to be the chief? Uh, I got to be the chief by default, really. <laughs> Let's be realistic. Um, we, uh, we, we had a chief for a number of years who couldn't come one year. And, um, and it was just decided amongst some of the elders that pretty much toss a coin and he could do it. And I got stuck with it. But it's right. good fun. And before we go, we need to have a close look at the Mohawk. It's uh, part of the package, I believe. It's uh, not necessarily part of the package, but it's just part of the fun. <laughs> Most of the guys do it and they enjoy it. Some of us um, haven't got enough hair to do it. But it's all good fun and there's only a week's difference between a good haircut and a bad one anyway. So come time next week, we all got to go back to work. It's just a quick buzz off and we're good to go. Masters games and how's the action been out there today? It's very hot and very dry. The back of the stroke is really asking for water. <laughs> and what's it like playing with uh, your friends and teammates out there? Oh, it's really good. Uh, and that's what these games are all about, is playing with your mates and friends. You know, and that's the one sort of thing that Alice Masters games bring. And they bring friendship that you always have for the rest of your life. And that's with your opponents as well. You know, like the people we're playing at moment now, Alice. Uh, Indians, they're, they're just fantastic people. They come up for our birthdays up in Townsville, all that sort of stuff. Just really, really great. And it looks like you've got a real good mix of ages out here right now as well, which is fantastic to see. Yes, it is. Uh, the oldest player there in the men's is 67, and the, the lady, I think she's 65. So, you know, it's pretty good.
Thomas Indian here. What's uh, your traditional name for the week? Run Pakya. And what does that stand for? Oh, it's just the way I encourage my teammates to run <laughs> if they're not running. <laughs> and how are they going out there today? Oh, sensational. They're running. Pakya. <laughs> really well. And uh, how's the Masters Games going for you so far? Magnificent. Opening was grand and now this first game is awesome. And you've been coming back for a few years now? This is my second campaign, so I'm hoping to be around for a few more. And what's it all mean for you? What's it all about? Uh, Alice Indians are a pretty special group of people, so it's always coming home to family, basically. Sydney, but I mean the Townsville was so sorry, what's up with the Let's go, Let's go, Let's go,
the Daily Wrap for day two. You can stay in touch with all the news and results by going to the Alice Springs Masters Games website at www.alicespringsmastersgames.com.au or by following us on Facebook or Twitter. And don't forget to share all of your Masters moments on social media by using the official games hashtag, hashtag ASMG2014. See you around at the Friendly Games.